The Indigenous Community read impact statements today in the sentencing hearing of Helmand Police Constable Brian Wren. Wren has pleaded guilty to assault in connection to the violent arrest of Patrick Tomchuk, an Indigenous man at a gas station last spring. A caution, this story contains disturbing video. Eric Viano has more. Wren appeared virtually in court today while Tomchuk appeared in person. Two community impact statements were read, focusing on the impact last year's incident had on the Indigenous community. On May 26th of last year, police were investigating a stolen vehicle at a gas station on Upper Sherman Avenue. Video recorded by a witness shows Tom Chuck unresponsive as a plainclothed police officer stomped on his head. Wren was suspended and charged with assault in connection with the incident. He pleaded guilty to assault in February. Appearing virtually, the National Vice Chief of the Congress of Aboriginal Peoples said Indigenous people are often targets of violence and discrimination by law enforcement saying the incident was a, quote, reminder of how little reconciliation has changed and that he can only guess there are a number of other incidents not caught on camera. Meanwhile, Aboriginal court worker Jessica Montana appeared in person echoing the same concerns, saying, quote, the violent assault on one of our relatives and members has a massive impact. And while physical injuries heal, intangible wounds last. Wren was given a chance to speak today as well. He apologized to Tom Chuck, the indigenous community, and the Hamilton Police Service, saying, quote, In no way was the actions conducted by myself on May 26 taught to me by the Hamilton Police Service. I went a little too far. I was scared for myself, I was scared for the community, and for my fellow officers. I am extremely sorry and have learned a valuable lesson from all of this. The court heard submissions from both sides today. However, the judge said a decision is not expected this evening. Eric Viano, CHCH News, Hamilton.